Welcome to another edition of the prolific, consistent, and controversial Sean's View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe, and I want to tell all my subscribers and viewers right now before I get into this raw review and give my highlights and my analysts of it, I just want to let you know that I will be picking up Grand Theft Auto 5. Make sure you tune in to Sean's View Entertainment as I will be doing an a, a unbagging, and I will also be doing gameplay as soon as it hits my hands. I'll do the unbagging tonight, I'll do the gameplay tomorrow, and if it catches wind, I'll keep doing it and doing it if it draws interest. Like I said, I'm not the best at video games, but I'll give it a college try. So tonight, Raw did a hell of a great job. They bounced back from what was not a great pay-per-view last night, Night of Champions. Uh, it left question marks as to what's going to happen on the next episodes of Monday Night Raw, and that's what I like. It keeps you keyed in, it keeps you glued in to what the next step and the next saga is going to be. Now, there's no doubt that this Raw was filled with controversy, conflict, collusion, and even conspiracies. Yes, conspiracy theories. Daniel Bryan, no longer the WWE champion. Triple H takes a championship and holds, and holds it up, and Daniel Bryan no longer the champion. We see Stephen McMahon rile up Randy Orton to go back to that place, go back to that dark, sick, sadistic side, that satanic side of Randy Orton, as Randy Orton destroyed and took out The Miz earlier tonight. Uh, we saw Dolph Ziggler finally get a win. He picked up a major victory over United States Champion Dean Ambrose. Um, like I said, I think it was a strong Raw. Very effective in promos, in-ring work. We've seen Ryback along with Paul Heyman. A little kiss on the cheek. That was a little weird and different. But I understood what they're trying to get by. We've seen the Big Show being forced to knock out Dusty Rhodes, who was there for a business proposition and turned out to be a lot worse than what it was. Um, like I said, there was there was a lot of highlights for, for Raw tonight. We also had a triple threat tag team match, which saw the Usos come out the number one contenders to the WWE Tag Team Championships. We've seen Randy Orton, like I said, take out the, the, the Miz very viciously. A very chaotic scene of it. It was very uncomfortable. And if you're wondering why I'm trying to rush through this Raw review, it's because i got to go pick up the game at 12 a.m. I will have a unbagging of uh, Grand Theft Auto V, and I will do a um, game commentary, gameplay, uh, coming up very, very soon. So I'd give Raw a, like I said, it was a solid comeback for Raw tonight. Um, following not a so strong pay-per-view last night. I give Raw about 8.5 out of 10 stars. And I felt they did a great job tonight. Uh, and what's gonna, what's the fate of the WWE Championship? Because as it stands right now, there is no WWE Champion. Make sure to like this video, subscribe, and pass the word along on every social media website you can to subscribe. Your comments, your opinions.